This is a poem I wanted to do for you. This is a poem that is just pure science, that's all. Just to remind you where you come from. A poem entitled Fatherhood. Human sperm are very small, five microns, that's about all. Just a cell with a dangly tail. Not as big as the ovum, but still you have to love them. And they're produced in the testes of the male. Beneath their shiny domes, they contain your chromosomes, and the tail can kick just like a leg. Nothing could be finer than to swim up a vagina in search of a rendezvous with an egg. The sperm has one ambition, and that's to gain admission to the female reproductive canal. And once he gets in it, he goes a millimeter a minute, along with 40 million of his pals. The sperm is no boob. When he smells the fallopian tube, he goes into some crazy figure eights about 10,000 times as those female enzymes keep egging him on to penetrate. Oh, 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 oh. The sperm all advance and they do their little dance, but only one gets through the egg membrane. And the union of those two, that's what led to you. So be thankful that your folks did not abstain. <laughs> that old man in the garage once let loose a great barrage. And though he is now ancient and infirm, and his breath is bad, children, he's your dad. Because he contributed his sperm. You can get them from a bank, or from Jim, or John, or Frank. But when it comes to fatherhood, there's just one man to thank. He was young and he was dumb, but when things began to hum, he did not withdraw. He became your paw. And that, my dear, is where we all came from. <laughs>